So a question I recently got is if I'm moving to a new neighborhood, what should I look for? Because you don't want to move into the, the worst neighborhood and sometimes not even the best neighborhood. You might be looking for a neighborhood that's just coming through gentrification right now, which we all love that buzzword, but it's just becoming an up and coming. Um, and you know what, some things you can look for is, is there any renovations going on in the neighborhood and what type of renovations? Are they a full brand new house being built or just quick fixes? Are you looking at what kind of cars are in the neighborhood? If you look at, are there a lot of kids in the neighborhood? Because if you start to see a lot of strollers through going through a neighborhood, it's a good indication that the older generation's moving out and a younger generation's moving in and having kids. So that can also be kind of like bringing new life to the neighborhood. You can check out how the schools are. What are the school ratings? You can check out what are the local stores that are close by. Also, is it close to transit? If you're an investor, you want to make sure that your tenants have a really good location for easy access to highways, roads, uh, bus and subways, if that's in the neighborhood. So keep an eye for those. And then just overall, are the lots manicured well? You know, I think that's going to be a big indication too of is there pride in that neighborhood of their own properties? I hope this helps. If you have any more questions or you want to get in touch with me, feel free to email me at info at davidmarkle.ca or give me a call myself, 416-805-9001, and I'm happy to help with any questions you have. Remax Prime Properties.